Hey guys, welcome back to Cosmic Chronicles. It's your girl back with another video and let me tell you, this one's going to make you want to sleep with the lights on. I've been diving into creepy Google Earth discoveries. The whole world is at your fingertips. One minute, you're in your neighborhood. The next, a desert mystery. Let's explore the creepiest, weirdest things on Google Earth. From strange symbols to abandoned places, it's wild. So buckle up, guys, because this is going to be a wild ride. Our journey begins in Garb, Sudan. This massive hill formation is unlike any hill I've ever seen. It features strange, lip-like contours and a giant crack down the middle. It reminds me of Stranger Things, like an interdimensional portal. We're heading to the southwestern Pacific Ocean, to Bosk Island. This place is seriously strange. On Google Earth, it's completely blacked out. Like someone erased it. Creepy, right? Some think it's a top-secret government base. Others link it to the Bermuda Triangle. But it's just a really dense forest, absorbing light. OK, so this next one is seriously weird, even for me. We're talking about a massive star, or maybe a mandala, carved into the ground outside of Beatty, Nevada. And you guys know I love a good conspiracy theory. So you already know where my head went with this one. I mean, it's just sitting there in the middle of the desert, this perfect geometric shape. How did it get there? Who made it? And why? Some people think it's a message from aliens, which, again, not entirely out of the realm of possibility. Others think it's some kind of ancient ritual site, which is equally as creepy. But the thing is, nobody really knows. Hold on to your hats, folks, because we're about to enter the Twilight Zone. This time, we're heading to Rhyolite, Nevada, an actual ghost town. How eerie is that? In the heart of this ghost town, there's a giant spiral formation. It's actually made of rocks. Surrounding the spiral are statues of men in white cloaks. Next, we venture into Wyoming, where things take a bizarre turn. Imagine hundreds, perhaps thousands, of these perfectly circular structures dotting the landscape. It's reminiscent of an alien invasion movie, don't you think? as if extraterrestrials descended and left these marks everywhere. Some speculate they are ancient burial grounds, adding to the eerie factor. Others believe they are linked to a clandestine government project, which wouldn't be too far-fetched. However, the prevailing theory is that they are remnants of old oil storage tanks. All right, folks, if you're easily frightened, you might want to skip ahead to the next chapter, because this one is seriously eerie. We're heading to Poland, to the mausoleum of Emil Becker. Honestly, this place gave me nightmares. It's an abandoned mausoleum, overgrown and decrepit, and in the middle of it all is this statue. But it's not just any statue. It's a terrifying, skeletal figure, like something out of a horror movie. It's like it's reaching out from beyond the grave, trying to grab you. I'm getting chills just thinking about it. All right, folks. This next discovery is truly intriguing and a bit eerie. We're heading to Kazakhstan, where a giant pentagram is etched into the Earth's surface. This pentagram is enormous, spanning over a thousand feet across. Naturally, when people see a pentagram, they often think of Satanism and the occult. But before jumping to conclusions, there's actually a perfectly innocent explanation for this one. It turns out, it's just an old Soviet-era park designed in the shape of a star. Next up, we're heading to the Netherlands, where things are about to get really strange. There's a mysterious symbol that looks like something out of an alien language, just sitting there in the middle of a national park. I mean, what could it be? Is it a message from extraterrestrials? A secret code left behind by an ancient civilization? Or maybe just a really elaborate prank? 
Well, it turns out the answer is a lot less thrilling than all that. It's actually just the logo of the National Park. Brace yourselves, folks, because we're about to step into the Twilight Zone. This time, we're heading to Inner Mongolia, China, where there's a granite mine that looks like it's straight out of an alien planet. I'm talking bright blue, folks, like electric blue. It's seriously mind-bending. Some believe it's some kind of toxic waste dump, which, given China's history, wouldn't be too shocking. Others speculate it's a portal to another dimension, which, honestly, wouldn't surprise me either. But the reality, as far as anyone can tell, is that it's just a bizarre optical illusion caused by the way Google Earth processes satellite images. This next one is truly one of the world's greatest mysteries and it's found in the Australian outback. It's known as the Mary Man, a colossal geoglyph, essentially a giant drawing on the ground, stretching over two miles long. It's enormous, depicting an Aboriginal hunter with a boomerang. It's so vast that it can be seen from space. But the real mystery is that nobody knows who created it or why. It just appeared one day and no one has ever claimed responsibility for it. Next up, we're heading back to the desert. This time to the Sahara Desert, where things are about to get really weird. I'm talking about a giant spiral structure carved into the sand, like something out of an alien landing strip. It's called Desert Breath, and it's actually an art installation created by three artists back in 1997. But even though we know who made it, it's still pretty eerie to look at, right? All right, folks, if you're fascinated by ancient Egypt, this one's for you. We're heading to Upper Egypt, where some believe they've uncovered a hidden pyramid. Imagine a massive triangular structure buried beneath the sand. Sounds like something straight out of Indiana Jones, right? But before you pack your bags for Egypt, it seems this might just be a case of wishful thinking. Next, we venture to Alberta, Canada, where things take a bizarre turn. Here. A natural rock formation resembles a giant human head wearing headphones. No joke. This formation is known as the Badlands Guardian, and it's undoubtedly one of the strangest sights you'll ever encounter. This next discovery is one of the most bizarre things I've ever come across on Google Earth. In the Gobi Desert, there are these enormous white lines zigzagging across the terrain. What could they possibly be? Some speculate they're secret messages from an ancient civilization. Others believe they might be landing strips for alien spacecraft. However, the most accepted theory is that they're used for calibrating satellites. All right, folks, this one's for all the true crime enthusiasts. We're heading to the Bahamas, where there's a sunken plain off the coast of Crooked Island. Some speculate it's the wreckage of one of Pablo Escobar's drug smuggling planes. I mean, it's definitely a possibility, right? But before you get too excited, the plane is completely intact. It doesn't look like it crashed at all. So, it's more likely that it was just a plane flying low over the water when Google Earth captured the image. And there you have it, explorers. Those are just a few of the creepiest, weirdest, most unexplained things we found on Google Earth. It's amazing to think there's still so much out there we don't know about, right? The world is full of mysteries, just waiting to be discovered. So next time you're curious, open up Google Earth and explore. You never know what you might find. It could be something ordinary or extraordinary. If this video sparked your curiosity, hit like, share it, and stay tuned for more with Cosmic Chronicles.